Are you that guy with over what 600 skins? Do you want to collect some of the best skins this game has to offer? Or you just want to reach World Collector SF? Yes. Keep watching because today we are here to talk about only the best. Hi guys, Kazuki here and in this video we are going to discuss the best skins you should have for your heroes. And just to remind you, this is the sequel to our previous video where we covered more heroes. So don't forget to check it out. Let's start the video off with our Momi Valentina Collector Celestial Judicator. This skin is really pretty and the introductory animation gives it a grand scale feeling. The color and hero model feel really epic. Next is one of the most anticipated entries of MLBP. The Leomo Ducati skin Diavel V4 Rider. This skin is great, stylish and full of energy. This was always one of the best skins ever made. But after the revamp, it reached a new height. Undoubtedly, the best skins of Saber. Comment down what do you think about the new revamped skill effect. We have already put Hayabusa in part 1 and even though we try to avoid repeating heroes but I just had to put this skin here. This is one of the best skins ever made with the flashy skill animation which can make you blind. Even after so many years it is the best skin of Clint. And if you think the collector is his best skin then I respect your opinion but you can have the wrong ones. The style, the effects and the model is just perfect. The latest addition to the Legends code, so of course it is gonna be the best. Everything about this skin is so cool and of course you can never go wrong with the Legend skin. Really amazing and highly underrated, this skin is my personal favorite and the skill effect also complements the quality of this and I also like the vibe they went for. One of the recent addition to the collection and genuinely a very good skin, the effects are flashy, the animation is smooth and the sound effects are top notch. Hands down the best skin of Hanami. Although not as good as the Hanabi, it is still a really good skin. The effects and detailing are just mind-boggling and the hero model is my personal favorite. After so long, there is La Goten new skin and it's a really good skin. It gives his abilities cool new effects, making his attacks feel way more powerful. The design makes him look super fierce and really boost his in-game presence. We have also put this into our list of must-have skins, so do check it out. Alright, let's talk about Banedita Collector skin. Honestly, this one is a real treat for Banedita mains. The design is just on point. Aside from that, she also got the legend skin treatment where the camera rotates instead of just the hero. That's automatically set the standard pretty high. Vexana becomes an ethereal source with this skin. The animation of her skills take on a celestial quality, featuring dazzling effects that make her ability appear more magical and awe-inspiring. In part 1, we used him as a troll as he didn't have any skin back then. But now it's different. His mythic skin is really great. Everything included, his skill effects and hero model looks Fire. To live is to trick the, the Xavier skin is definitely giving off some serious anime vibes, especially if you are into JJK. 
Every time you use his abilities, it feels like you are in the middle of an epic anime battle. Honestly, I love how they nailed the theme with this one. This can give God a mystical vibe with those flowing robes and glowing essence. The swirling energy on his skills looks great and adds a magical touch. I think it really suits his mage persona and makes his ability feel more intense. Kai looks super cute and festive with this skin. The new party themed animations makes his ability more fun and flashy. It's a perfect skin to celebrate the game's anniversary. If you enjoy playful skins, this one a must have for Akai. This skin gives Kufra a darker, more mysterious vibe. The eerie arcane effects on his abilities makes him look even more threatening. It's honestly one of the best looks for him if you are into a more sinister style. Red Green as a futuristic warrior is just cool. The sleek armor and glowing elements make his skills feel fast and powerful. I love how the high-tech look adds a modern twist to his character. Definitely a skin that makes him stand out. This skin is a perfect for Estes, giving him a championship vibe. The bright, flashy skill effects makes him feel like a true team leader. It's a skin that adds a confidence to his presence in game, and I'm here for it. Aurora looks stunning with his icy makeover. The dazzling skill effects gives her a take a more majestic feel. If you are a fan of her frosty theme, this skin makes her even more enchanting to play. Vincita looks like a true warrior king with his golden armor. His animation are grand and impactful, which is a huge upgrade. I think this skin really boosts his overall vibe and makes him feel more powerful. This skin gives Dairoth an agey demonic flair. The aggressive effect on his skills fits his relentless playstyle perfectly. It's got that rebellious energy that makes his attacks feel even more intense. A solid pick for Dairoth Maid. They look so cool with their luxurious matching gear. The flashy animations add a stylish touch to their teamwork, making them feel more connected in battle. I really like how this skin brings out their adventurous side. Balman becomes a fierce warlord in this skin. The fiery visuals on his abilities looks amazing and really matches his aggressive playstyle. If you want to make Balman feel more intimidating, this skin does the job perfectly. A Star Wars inspired Argus? Yes, please. His skills now have that cosmic futuristic energy, making him look like a galactic warrior. It's a legendary makeover that really adds an epic vibe to his character. Ben as the ultimate pirate lord is just awesome. The sea-themed skill effects with water and anchors brings out his maritime vibe perfectly. It adds a lot of personality to his gameplay and makes his attacks looks really cool. This skin gives Bruno a sleek, high-tech look. The glowing animations and electric energy makes his abilities feel more dynamic and fast-paced. It's a great pick if you are into futuristic design for marksmen. Zelon gets a luxurious upgrade with this skin. The golden armor and dazzling effects makes him look like a true champion. I love how it adds an extra layer of prestige to his character. Natalia looks sleek and deadly in this skin. The smooth animation gives her that refined assassin vibe, making her even more elegant in stealth. If you are into stealthy characters, this skin makes your gameplay feel extra satisfying.
Alpha dives into a dark, sinister theme with this skill. The shadow skill effects are spot on for his aggressive style. It really amps up his menacing look, which I think makes playing him a lot more thrilling. Ruby gets a fresh, modern look that's playful yet fierce. Her vibrant skill effects add excitement to her moves, making her combat style feel more fun. I like how this skin adds a lively twist to her character. This skin gives Johnson a sleek, high-end vehicle look. The flashy animation makes his car form even cooler and more thrilling when he charges into battles. A must-have if you want to upgrade his entrance. Harley becomes a classic magician with this skin. The magical spark effects on his abilities are whimsical and charming. It adds a touch of sophistication to his tricks, making him a lot more fun to play. Irithel and Leo looks amazing in this Ducati-inspired skin. The animation are fast-paced and giving off that thrilling speed vibe, just like a motorcycle race. If you love sleek designs, this skin is a perfect fit. You saw this coming, this is the best skin in the Fovius collection so far. So guys, what do you think about this list? Which hero or skin we missed in your opinion? That will be all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Keep supporting Kazuki Official.